What up, Fight World? It's your boy Ego, and I'm back with some more boxing. Now, this is just a quick segment I want to add to the channel. Very simple premise. It's basically called Ego's Matchmaker, and as the title suggests, it's me playing matchmaker. I'm going to really just uh, break it down and let you know why I think these would be exciting matches. Um, obviously, this is 100% fantasy. I have no control over the fights that are actually signed. I will just let you know what fantasy fights that I would want to see and why I would want to see them and, and why it would be a, um, a good showcase. So um, there's all this talk about Mayweather versus Khan. I've s talked about this until I'm blue in the face. I don't think the fight should happen. Um, not at the moment. I think Khan has been knocked off the ladder. He's two out of four in his last um, four fights. And a lot of them weren't tremendous performances yeah he looked good in the lamont peterson fight but so did lamont peterson who later got beat by lucas matisse another 140 pounder um yeah he looked good in the beginning of the danny garcia fight but by the third round danny garcia had his timing down he got dropped and knocked out um and dropped repeatedly so i mean i i can only give him a certain letter grade for that um then as far as the other come back he had a new trainer test the waters with a light puncher carlos molina so he did what he had to do against a light puncher danny garcia said it i said it um before the fight danny garcia said after the fight then he fought julio diaz and he had every advantage and he really didn't look great so if it were up to me i would say scratch the mayweather versus amir khan fight which people will watch by default but i don't think um people are, are calling for it yes it'd be interesting um i'm i'm really basing off merit like i said i don't think con deserves it two years ago or whenever cool you could have made the case for it but not recently con fell off the ladder needs to get back i would definitely watch it just because it's interesting in terms of a, the matchup con has a lengthy frame um and he has quick hands so i'd just be anxious to see how it plays out um Khan has an exciting fight style, so I would watch it for that reason. I just don't think it's warranted. Um, a better match would be Mayweather versus Pacquiao. Finally, put that to bed. We'll see who the best fighter is, even in the mid-30s. Let's see who wins that particular fight. Finalize that. Get it done. Get it out of the way. Great fight to have on whoever wins that one on their resume. And on the undercard for this fight, Adrian Broner, if he can get past Marcos Maidana this Saturday, versus Amir Khan. Now, this fight makes a whole hell of a lot more sense. Again, with Mayweather, he's he's coming off of the Canelo victory, who was a young, strong champion. It was a unification. It was an, at a higher weight. Um, so, to me, it's taking a step backward to face Khan right now when Khan hasn't looked spectacular. But for Adrian Broner, someone who's young, Someone who's still in question. Uh, we don't know everything that Adrian Broner can do. Um, so if he can get past Maidana, excellent fight. You have two fighters um, who are young. Broner's a little bit younger in his career. I think at the moment, Amir Khan has a better resume with wins over Maidana. Um, if, if Broner can beat Maidana, then they'll both have victories over Maidana. And Khan has the Marco Antonio Barrera, Zab Judah wins. He has other, McCloskey, he has other impressive um, wins, I guess you could say. So he has the better resume. Broner, again, there's a lot of critics and a lot of fans who question th certain things about Broner. So at welterweight, um, I'd be anxious to see that particular matchup. And I think that's a million times better than Mayweather versus Khan. So Amir Khan versus Broner, um, I think that fight would do astronomical numbers on a Mayweather Pacquiao fight. It would be just as big as the Canelo fight, if not bigger, even with Pacquiao being knocked out recently. So that is the ego matchmaking at its finest. Mayweather versus Pacquiao on the undercard. You have Lil Bro, AB, Adrian Broner versus Mayweather is a chicken, Amir Khan. Um, let me know what you guys think of this matchmaking. If you like it, if you hate it, why? Leave a comment, let me know. As always, hate, comment, or subscribe. Till next video is Ego signing off.